love. So first of all, I'm not done with the room. I'm still looking for me a white area rug to go in the middle of my floor. I really want that white. I think it'll make the room pop. I'm not sure if I want to get a big one or just like a five by seven or something like that. But I have the light off in here. And the reason why I have the light off because I want to share with you this chandelier here. So you haven't seen this chandelier because it's a new purchase. I'm loving it. It came from Wayfair and it was very, very affordable. I've always thought chandeliers would be like a thousand, two thousand and stuff like that. I had no idea you can get chandeliers for under 200 bucks and under 100 bucks. So this particular chandelier, it came from Wafer as I stated, and it was under 200 bucks. So I love this. It has nine lights in there and it's very, very pretty. I can't really, if I turn the lights on, you're not going to really be able to see how pretty it is, but you can see how pretty it is from here and I'm loving it. I'm going to leave the link below to the chandelier just in case anyone wants to check it out. So let's get started. I'm going to start over here. So what I have over here is this wall plaque. It came from Z Gallery. I've had it for a while now. I purchased it when it was on sale. And these pics over here in the corner actually came from Z Gallery as well. The vase here at the bottom came from Pier 1. I've had it for about six or seven years. My drapes came from Home Goods. I'm loving that mixture. At first, I wanted to do all white, and I couldn't find the white drapes that I wanted. So I put these teal ones up there, and I've had these teal uh, drapes for quite some time. They're velvet, and they came from TJ Maxx online. And so I haven't really been able to find the perfect drapes. So I put these white drapes up here, and when I put them up there, I'm like, hmm, I wonder how they would look with that teal in the middle. So I like it like that. So anyway, um, this face, I kind of like the drapes to be like straight down, but I have this, I used to have silver in this room. So I have this silver thing here, and I don't like it. I'm going to wait till I get some gold, and so I kind of cover that up. So that's why it's kind of looking like, the curtain is like swag like that. But this face, now let me tell you, this is actually a stand. It's so unique and I so, so love it. It came from Home Goods, and I think they have them right now because this is a recent purchase for me. And it has the face all the way around, four different faces. You can see one over here, one over here, and one over here. So uh, the main boxes came from Z Gallery. My bookshelf came from Rooms to Go, but you can get your hands on this from Wayfair. So I'll leave the link to the Wayfair link. And the books and the bookends came from Z Gallery. My super cute bunny over here and the egg came from Pier 1. It's recent purchases. The Sand Globe, I'm sure, I don't know the name of that, you guys. Hourglass. It came from Z Gallery. I've had it for a couple of years. Uh, this floral arrangement here, let me see here. It's a DIY by me. The florals came from at home during the Christmas season. And the, the glam things here came from Pier 1. The actual vase came from Home Goods. The box here from Home Goods. Glows from Home Goods. The vase here came from Home Goods. The other items at the bottom here came from Z Gallery. Moving over here to this side, my mirrors came from Home Goods. The lamp came from Home Goods. The sideboard or credenza came from Wayfair. The gold and teal decorated vases came from Z Gallery. The Easter bunnies came from Home Goods. The candle holders here came from Home Goods. The candles from Z Gallery. We move around here. This wall art here, I love it. Came from Home Goods. It was a steal. And um, my glasses came from Z Gallery. The, lan the lantern came from Home Goods. The bunny inside the lantern came from Home Goods. The gold candles came from Michaels. The pineapples from Pier One. Bar card itself came from Home Goods. The gold stirrups here 
came from Z Gallery. And the pineapples at the bottom came from Pier 1. Glasses at the bottom came from Home Goods. Pineapples came from Pier 1. Okay, moving on this side, the wall art came from Home Goods. The picks in the ginger jar came from Pier 1. Both of them, both pairs, both sets came from Pier 1. Uh, ginger jar came from Z Gallery. Let me turn this lamp off. That's so much better. That lamp is a recent purchase. It came from Home Goods. Uh, the Happy Easter and the little bunny here came from Home Goods. I like the little polka dots on the ears. And my books here came from Amazon. I have a link below. They're very affordable if you like to check them out. The glasses came from Home Goods. The white and gold Ming boxes came from Z Gallery. And those tea light holders back there came from Z Gallery. And my, this is a sofa sofa table here. It actually came from Home Goods. And it's a recent purchase. So if I move back here, these acrylic shelves here came from Z Gallery. I think I paid like 10 bucks for those. They were a steal. I kind of think they're in an awkward position, but I have them up there. So I'm going to just leave them up there and work with it. My candles here, these are super cute. These candles actually came from um, E Favor Mart. They're so cute. I like them because they have the, oh, I don't have any batteries in all of them. They have the uh, string lights around them. Let me see. These, yeah, the battery is working too. Oh, it's hard to keep batteries in candles, you guys. But I love these. But you can see how pretty they are. So these little bunnies here, you can get your hands on these right now. They're in, they're at Home Goods. I've seen them recently, but I had those from last year. Okay, um, so this bunny set here came from Home Goods. These little boxes here came from Home Goods. And these floor picks right here, oh my gosh, I love these. These picks actually came from Pier 1, all of them. Pier 1 have like a sale where you can buy one, get one half off. And I love their picks. I Between Z Gallery and Pier 1, those are my favorite places to get picks from. So I love this arrangement. I love it because it's making a big statement. And that's what I like. I like things that make statements. So this wall art that you see in the back here came from Hobby Lobby. So this chair, I've had this chair for about eight or nine years from Wayfair. Um, I'm going to get rid of it, but until I find me another chair, I'm just going to go ahead and hang on to this one. A uh, pillow here from Z Gallery. I love this pillow. So cute. And the throw from Z Gallery. And my desk, everybody knows it's a recent purchase. It came from Wayfair. I'm loving it. I would open a desk, but I just threw a whole bunch of junk in there, so... I'm not ready for you to see that. And my little planner here came from Z Gallery. This was a good, this was a good steal right here. I paid like seven bucks for this planner. They had it like 70% off and they kind of be a little expensive on some things, but it was regular price 29, but I paid seven bucks for it. It's really cute. I can't wait to start using this one. I'm actually going to take it to work with me because I need a planner at work. So, if I move over here, you can see I have this little, um, am I making you guys dizzy? I have these little ottomans here. These ottomans came from Ross, and they also can be used as storage. I'm going to show you what I have. I actually use these as storage. I have extra candles and stuff in here. Don't judge. See? Extra candles. <laughs> I'm just being real with you guys. I, there's no use of us being fake. And I have um, more dec decorations in here. So, these are perfect for a homebody like me that loves to do home decor. So, I forgot the desk item. So, this He Has Risen sign here, plaque, came from Home Goods. That mirror. Okay, I forgot the desk. So this he is risen plaque came from Home Goods. This mirror here came from Home Goods, and some more candles. And my little uh, feathers here came from Michaels. I love these. So that pretty much sums up 
my home office. Again, I'm not through because I definitely want an area rug in here, but for now, I'm done. I'm not gonna buy anything until I find that perfect area rug. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 